Hello everyone, in this video we have solved this interesting math question x square minus y square is equal to 27 and x y is equal to 18 we will find out x plus y is equal to what so how to solve this math olympiad question so our first equation is x square minus y square is equal to 27 so i can say x square minus y square is equal to 27 then we know that a square minus b square it will be a plus b times a minus b according to this case i can say here is x plus y times x minus y is equal to 27 then i use both sides whole square so i can say easily it will be x plus y whole square and it will be x minus y whole square is equal to 27 square i use both side whole square then i can say easily a plus b whole square it will be a square plus 2ab plus b square and here is minus so it will be a square minus 2ab plus b square according to these rules i can say here is x square plus y square plus 2xy times and here is x square plus y square minus 2xy is equal to 27 times 27 then this equation becomes look here is x square plus y square and here is x square plus y square so if you think it is a this is a and this is b this is b so i can see easily a plus b times a minus b according to this rules i can see easily it will be x square plus y square whole square minus 2xy whole square is equal to 27 times 27 it will be 7 to 9 then this equation becomes look here is x square plus y square whole square but in this case i can see it will be 2 times xy remember that you know that xy it will be 18 so i can say it will be 18 whole square is equal to 2729 then i can say here is x square plus y square whole square is equal to 729 and i move on this term this side so i can see it will be plus 2 times 18 it will be 36 square then this equation becomes here is x square plus y square whole square and in this case i can see it will be 7 to 9 plus 36 square it will be 12 6 9 then i can say here is x square plus y square whole square and this plus this it will be 2 0 2 5 then i use both side square root so the square root is cancelled so we will find out x square plus y square is equal to square root 2025 it will be 45 then we know that a square plus b square it will be a plus b whole square minus 2 a b and here is 45 then i can say easily x plus y whole square here is x plus y whole square and remember that 2 times x y is equal to 18 is equal to 45 then i can see easily this equation becomes x plus y whole square minus 2 times 18 it will be 36 is equal to 45 then it will be x plus y whole square is equal to 45 plus 36 it will be 81 then if i use both side square root then square root is cancel we we'll find out here is x plus y is equal to plus minus 9 so this is our final answer now if you solve this questions others method so look our first equation is x square minus y square is equal to 27 and we are find out here is x square plus y square is 45 so i can say our first equation is x square minus y square is equal to 27 look 
so if i add this equation and this equation so i can say it will be 2x square look 2x square and when i add i can say y square and y square are cancel and 45 plus 27 it will be 72 then if i divide both side 2 so it will be x square is equal to 36 then if i use both side square root then i can easily it will be x is equal to plus minus 6 and others case if i subtract both equation so i can easily y square minus y square but minus minus it will be plus so i can say 2y square and 45 minus 27 it will be 18 and x square minus x square it will be 0 but in this case if i divide both side 2 so i can say y square is equal to 9 and y is equal to plus minus 3 i use both side square root then our final answer is x plus y is equal to what so i can say x is equal to plus minus 6 plus and y is equal to plus minus 3 so if i add we are find out here is final answer is plus minus 9 this is our final answer so if you enjoy this video please subscribe my channel and like this video goodbye take care